Hello, everyone. Welcome to Harry B's Creative Minds channel. Uh, it's a how-to guides channel on various pieces of software, mainly focusing on things like um, video editing, um, digital marketing type um, tools that you can use on your day-to-day -day basis when you want to create videos or content. Today, I'm going to be focusing on how you can mute um, a video. Um, or remove the sound from a video um, with uh, Filmora 12.5. It's pretty um, good, pretty neat, and pretty easy tool to use. Um, and we'll jump straight right into it. First of all, go to google.com, type in Filmora. It gives you um, the sponsored links. Um, just click on free download. Buy the free download. You can buy it as well. There's two options there. You can look through the pricing. Um, pricing, you've got an annual plan of uh, 40 uh, 99 and then you've got a petrol plan of 65 99 Various features, take your time to take a look and see if it's something that you want to use. But going back to the um, attention or focus for this uh, video, once you've installed Filmora on your local laptop or or, um, or a desktop or whatever it may be, you can you will then be presented with the tool which looks like this. You will see your first prompt will be add new projects, which will be a screen before this one. And then you want to um once you've opened that up, name the project to whatever you want. And then you add in um, your media by clicking on import media with this plus sign. Um, when you click on the plus sign, it will take you to your local drive. You search for the video that you want to um, remove the sound from or mute, and then it will appear here. Um, I'll just click on this. So you can see that this is a video that does have some sound. Click on the way to the end. Yeah, and then just click on the rules. You then want to add it to the timeline. So double click on the plus sign, and you can see this has been added to the timeline. And then if you move your cursor to the right, you'll see it put mouse over, it just wants a padlock, and then you want to look for the mute button. So it says mute, unmute. So this is unmuted, this is mute. And then now it, this is muted. And then you can click it again and it's you'll have the sound back on. So let's play it with the sound on again. Click on stop. The timeline goes back to the start and then click on this and this is muting the button and click on play, there you go, no sound. Go all the way to the end, no sound whatsoever. So you can see the timeline as well here. It's just over a minute long in terms of this video. It's 1.3, one minute and three seconds. Um, tells you the video name. Um, what else do I think could be useful? Finally, what you want to do is you're thinking, well, how do I export this? I mean, you can play around with the um, features if you want, but I'm looking, um, really focusing on just muting uh, for this video. Um, then you can click on export. You can click on create video, export it, selected uh, clips, export to device, and then you can upload to YouTube um, and TikTok. You need to sign into each one of these, so um, at least for YouTube, TikTok, and VMO. Vimo before you can upload. Um, and then I'll just, for this video, I'll just click on export the device. Um, I'll just call this something like, um, sound. It's going to my local drive. Um, it's got presets, uh, then you've got the format. You can choose whatever device you want. For this, I'm just going to um, make it to be a iPhone. We've got the resolution. You can change that around frames as well. Got 24 or 30. Here we can use 30. 
and you can change the thumbnail. And then you click on export. And then if you look, you will see it says converting, tells you the time remaining. Um, then there's a sound reminder. So when, once it's finished and um, converting, you'll hear a kind of a, a prompt. There you go. Then you can go straight to open folder. And then it just says airplane, no sound. That's one of my downloads. And you double click on that. There you go. You have a video um, of airplanes uh, with no sound. And that's pretty much how you do it. It's a very short, very easy step-by-step -step guide on how you do it. If you like this video, please let me know. Um, um, I hope I can um, create some other videos which will be intuitive and helpful to people who want to create videos and use various features with various tools. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. Let me know what you think. Um, thank you very much.